What would you say to the person who consistently encounters challenges? Honestly, I would have to say to them, get used to it. Somehow or another, there's this message that has been put out in the culture that life was meant to be just a crystal stare all the way around. I don't agree with that. Um, the problem is, if you believe that, at the moment you face a challenge or challenges, you're going to be tempted to give up. Let me tell you this. You will forever, as long as you're breathing, experience challenges. So don't make them more than what they should be. What you think about, you bring about. You expand. And because we're not used to being challenged, we think on it too much. We expand it. It becomes bigger than what it should be. You should look at challenges like you look at breathing. It's a part of life, baby. You can't, you can't, you can't get around it, right? Now, here is, now let's be sober-minded in our approach. But you should look at victory and winning just the same way. That's a part of life, too. And if you're winning without challenges, you're losing. Watch this. And if you're, if, you're, if you're losing or experiencing a many challenges without winning, you're a loser. <laughs> I mean, that just is what it is. So that's what I would tell anyone that's about to do something that they've never done before. You're going to have major wins but you will face the wind called challenge. So the question is not, am I talented enough? The question is not, do I have the education or the pedigree or the background or the socioeconomic status to accomplish my goals? The question is, can I endure the wind that comes with winning? And that's what most people, they can handle that kind of challenge. There is a wind that comes with winning. And you have to endure the wind, or in my opinion, go in the flow of wind and allow that wind to blow you wherever you need to go. A lot of people think they're facing challenges, but they're facing their fight with the flow. Stop fighting the flow. The flow is trying to take you where you want to go. Hmm. The flow is trying to give you some no, K-N-O-W. But you're fighting the flow. Don't fight the flow. Go with the flow. If you believe in any kind of source, any kind of energy, universal power, God, whatever it is, then you should believe that there is a flow that is divine for you to get you to go and to get you to know. Next question!